Yes, I have a lot of Starbucks mugs. <laughs> How's everybody doing? Oh. Thumbs up, guys. Don't forget thumbs up. Hey, girl, what's going on, Alex? What you doing today? Hi, Peterson. It is Tiger. Hello, Withering Cottage. Hi, Cindy. Hello, Linda. Yes, I actually put makeup on today, guys, with my left hand. Driving home from sourcing. Yes. I'm doing good. Hi, Belinda. Yeah, I actually, today's the first day I put on a bra. <laughs> It took a little, but I figured out how to do it. <laughs> so, yes. Uh, yeah. That was interesting. Hi, Pam. Yes, a bra. <laughs> Could I just say I did not miss not wearing one? <laughs> oh, thrifter, not hoarder. Glad I could oblige. Hey, Kelly. Hi, Julia. How are you doing, Julia? Miss Match Socks, hello. I know, right, Peterson? It's like so comfortable. I, well, the only reason I put one on today is because I got my ma to take me to Goodwill, or yeah, to Goodwill for uh, Senior Tuesday. <laughs> Hi, Cindy. Yeah, that was an adventure, let me just tell you. Hi, Michelle. I'm feeling, I'm feeling really, really good. I'm going to the doctor's tomorrow to get my stitches out. So that'll be a plus because they're itching. They're driving me nuts. Hey, Stephanie Patterson. <laughs> yes. So, yeah, that, so that's the only reason I put a bra on today, because I had to go out in public. <laughs> oh, me too, Janet, trust me. Oh, thanks, Stephanie. Yeah, so I just figured, um, I hope everybody gets their packages okay. Oh, that's awesome, Julia. That is awesome. I know, Joelle. I understand. <laughs> yeah, I, you know what, guys? When I started pulling out all of the mugs, can I tell you that I am not kidding? I have... Uh, Binks's tail going up my nostril. He just knocked all my stuff on the floor. I have uh, 30, 37 or 38 mugs. Hi, Nate. Binks, you can't be on my lap, buddy. Hi. Can you, can you just maybe lay over here on the chair next to me? Here, come over here. Because mom's going to have to get up, and I can't. <laughs> He's just not having it. He is not having it. He's on my lap, and he's not moving. <laughs> um, so check this out, guys. So I go over my mom's house. We're getting ready to leave to go to Goodwill. She goes, we go out into the, the car's in the garage. She goes to open the car door and it was already opened. Hence, the dome light stayed on all night, so the battery was dead. She said, hi, Maria. She, hi, Cam. She goes, I don't remember leaving the door open, but your nephew was running around and playing in here yesterday. He probably got in the car and then left the door open and... So the battery was dead. 
So a friend of the family had just left. So we hurried up and called him real quick. And he came back and put it on. Um, you took off work early today, Jeffrey. <laughs> That's my guy. <laughs> um, so he came back and put it on the charger. Hi, Tracy. Got us all charged up. So... He, he goes, make sure you run it for a while, you know, before you turn it off. So we get to Goodwill, which is only like two miles, you know. And I thought my mom was going to leave it run. She shut it off. And then it wouldn't start again. So we go in the store. We call my brother. He goes, call AAA. So we call AAA. I was in there shopping. Hi, Sharon. I was in there shopping for an hour and a half, around an hour and a half, uh, you know, thereabouts. Checked out, wrapped everything, went out, put it in the car, and still had to wait another 20 minutes for the guy to get there. The stupid GPS um, got him lost. <laughs> so he finally came and charged up the battery. Then we had to go right to AutoZone. And it was just like a long, drawn-out day. Like, I should have just took a cab. I should have just took a cab. But whatever. So I got to go thrifting today. Yay! Got some good stuff, too. So I am very happy about that. I'm not happy at the fact that there's 75 people in here and only 31 thumbs up, guys. Come on, thumbs up are free. They're free. Hi, James Hooker. <laughs> Sounds like you everyday thrifter. <laughs> Yeah, it's, uh, so I, I got to share something with everyone. I had gotten some friend mail a while ago and just haven't been able to open it in a video. Finally, I just opened it yesterday. Right, exactly. Exactly, Alex. Yep. Thank you, Belinda. How you feeling, sweetheart? I know you had a, a rough go of it. This is a friend mail. This glass. Hi, Maria. This was sent to me by um, by Christy Taylor. I love it. Hi, Lori. Blue flamingo. Um, but Binks, would you stop? He's. He's grabbing a hold of my hand with his paws and trying to chew my fingers. Um, I got some beautiful handmade jewelry. Um, the girl's name, it looks to me um, that her name is Katzy, K-A-T-Z-Y. Look at what she made me, you guys. Look at those earrings. And then she made me a necklace to match. Catsy, yes. Why, you know Catsy Peterson? Aren't those awesome? Ooh, oh, shit. Oops. <laughs> Oops. It fell out of the package. Look at that. Isn't that awesome? Let me take the earrings out and show you. Look at, look at how cute. <laughs> I love them. 
So I have got to send her a thank you card because these are just gorgeous. Oh my goodness. I just love them. Um, I'm gonna sh I'm gonna do a haul video when I'm done, and I'm going to um, I want to show these in my haul video so everyone else can see them as well. Aren't they awesome, Lori? I'm like, wow, these are amazing. So I just wanted to share those with everybody. Um, but anywho, okay, so um, it's nothing but mugs today, and I have. A mug for everybody, I think. <laughs> you got vitamins in the mail? I can't take vitamins. Like, I can only take certain vitamins. I can't take a multivitamin. All right, so everything is a set price today. There's no offer-ups, none of that stuff. Um, I'm not measuring anything. Um, I will tell you how many ounces it is, but I'm not going to like measure the cups and all that stuff. We're going to make this as simple as possible. And hopefully I will be able to package all of these up myself, um, without asking my aunt to help me again, because she's going to have to help me after my sale Saturday. So I think I'll be able to manage, um, the cups. Um, no, I'm just going to record one, Alex. So, you know, have at it. If you want to do one, go for it. I'm just going to record one. I'm going to do a front porch haul if it doesn't start pouring rain. <laughs> Everything's on the porch that I bought today. Oh, no worries there, thruf thrufter. <laughs> Thrifter. Yep, go ahead, my girl. You go right ahead. Okay, so um, I guess I'm going to start with this mug. Now, um, I had somebody buy me um, one of these mugs, which I, I have in my curio cabinet. And then I found one as well. So I don't need two. So I have this gorgeous Precious Moments cup. It is just beautiful. Uh, it's a Christmas cup, as you can see. Very muted colors, very pretty. I absolutely love it. And there's no chips, no cracks, no crazing. It's in excellent condition. This would make a nice gift for someone, if you know someone that collects precious moments. Hi, Midge. So this beautiful um, cup is $7, and it is number 27. $7, number 27. I know, isn't it beautiful? I just cannot resist precious moments, They because they're precious. They are. They're just beautiful. So if nobody buys it, I'll try to find room in my curio cabinet, but... You know. Okay. Next up, I have some restaurant wear. This is a beautiful set right here, guys. This is in perfect condition. Perfect condition. Hi, Carol. Um, you get this beautiful cup. This is Syracuse China. Syracuse China. And this is the pretty pattern that's on it. I just love it. Look at the handle. And here is the saucer. I know there's a lot of people that collect restaurant wear. And this would be a really, um, a really nice set to add to the collection. Even if you collect like uh, restaurant wear personal creamers, um, this would even look cute with that collection. Um, so this uh, set is $8. $8 and it's number four. Nice and clean. $8, number four. 
Zenzord. I got you, Zenzord. Thank you so much. Um, Zen, don't forget to send me your, um, your information, okay? What's up, Zen? <laughs> Thank you so much. I appreciate it. That's a really nice set. Hey, Kevin. How are you? You smashed your finger? Oh, my God. <laughs> hey, Crystal. How you doing, sweetie? When is your next sale? Because I would like to get myself some jewelry. Okay, thanks, buddy. I appreciate it. All right. For those of you who are Dunkin' Donut fans, and if you should live in New York, I have this awesome New York Dunkin' Donuts cup, mug, cup, whatever. It's got all of the... Um, I'm trying to turn my hand. <laughs> Statue of Liberty, the bridge, the Brooklyn Bridge. Yeah, this is a nice, nice Thursday. Okay, Thursday. Um, this is, let's see, how many ounces? Um, it doesn't say, but it's from 2012. And I would have to say that this is probably 12 ounces. And it's orange on the inside. So this one is $6, number 25. $6, number 25. And just so everyone knows, all of these cups are in really fantastic condition. They don't have any utensil marks in them. No chips, no cracks. Well, most of them. Oh, Lynn. Got you, Lynn. Um, there's one or two that might have a little, uh, like, chip on the bottom, but that's about it. So. Aw, uh, thanks, Midge. Hey, Angela. What's going on, girl? Okay, so Lynn, she got number 25. Thank you, Lynn. All right. Uh, let's see. What else do we got here? Okay. Um, I also have, um, I've never seen these before, and um, that's why I bought it when I, oh, he's from Brooklyn? Oh, how cool. So he likes coffee. <laughs> And he says, how you doing? Can I have a cup of coffee? <laughs> You're blackout. What's blackout? Anyways, um, this is a Food Network cup. How cool is this cup? Right? Look at that. I have never seen anything like it. Food Network. Um, this is probably, I would say, six or seven inches tall. I do not believe it has the ounces on here. But it is microwave and dishwasher safe. Um, this probably holds, I would say, 12 to 14 ounces. And it is so cool. Uh, this cup is going to be $5, number 12. $5, number 12. For the Food Network mug. Yeah, it is. It's pretty cool, though. It's nice and clean. I love it. I think it's neat. I love the polka dots. All right. Whoops. Oh, Jeffrey, I got you. Food Network, Jeffrey. Thank you. 
Thank you, thank you. All right. Uh, no, 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 buddy. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh. <laughs> He's back. <laughs> I know. Me too, Zen. Me too. You know what? It's funny, but when I go to like estate sales and stuff like that, I always look for useful items. Like any like um, cotton balls that are, you know, closed, sealed, you know, any kind of stuff like that. Cleaning supplies that are, you know, still good, all that stuff. Hi, bud. What's up? Hi. Can I have my paper back, though? It's okay. I just want my paper back. Excuse me. Thanks. Thanks a lot. Okay. No, don't lay on it over here now. Oh, my God, you guys. Uh, okay. Hi. Hi, buddy. Hello, sir. Yes, I see you. I was gone for, like, you know, four hours, so he's, like, losing his mind. Um, okay, I have a... A winter mug and this one I just love this mug this is made by the company tag and it is this adorable snowman mug he's he or she is skiing down the hill and it says hope this is probably a 16 ouncer possibly 18 ounces I know they make the best mugs I would say this is like 18 ounces at least. That's a nice cup of coffee right there. Um, very clean. Hi, Jess. Um, yes, you did get a package today. So this cup is $8. Hi, Gabby. $8, number nine. <laughs> Right, Kevin? I know. Um, you don't realize how lucky you are to have all your extremities until you don't have the use of one. <laughs> um, but anyways, okay, so $8, number nine for this one. Yeah, for sure. Okay. Um, I have... <clears throat> oh, Jeffrey wants number nine. Okay, I got you, Jeffrey. That's a nice mug. Thank you, sir. Do I need to tell you what Binks is licking right now while he's on my table? Binks. 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 Come on, get going. Come on, get down. Get down, go on, thank you. <sighs> to make sure I wash the table when I'm done. <laughs> oh Lord have mercy. <coughs> okay, I have a couple of Starbucks, you are here mugs. Uh, or you were here, you are here, whatever. <laughs> um, I have an Oregon. I love this one because of the colors. This is just dirt right there. That'll come right off. Excellent condition. Just gorgeous. I love this cup. Uh, this is... Uh, let me read it the right way. This is from 2016. 
and it is 14 ounces. Hi, Deanne. It is $10, and it's number 18. $10, number 18. Oh, that's all you got was the mug? <laughs> Hi, Gina. <laughs> I love the mug, though. Look at the colors. Look how pretty that is. I love it. All right, $10, number 18 for the Oregon mug. Then I also have, and I think this is my daughter's, a Florida. We have a Florida mug. And again, there's the Starbucks. Perfect condition. 14 ounces. And the Florida uh, cup is also $10. Number 19. She never used it. Uh, $10, number 19, for the Florida mug. Jeffrey Ross, number 19. All right. Whoops. All right. Okay, I bought this for my daughter and apparently she didn't like it because she never used it. So if there's anybody out there who has the letter J for an initial, I have this beautiful gold detailing cup, mug. It's got the letter J on both sides. It has a gold handle and the gold rimming on the top and the bottom. There is a spot here where the gold um, didn't take, but that was in the manufacturing. It's not a chip. Um, this is probably, um, I would say, a 14 ounce uh, mug. And this is going to be $6, number eight. $6, number eight. Very clean, very, very nice mug. Oh, Gina, Vintage Digs. Okay, I got you, girl. Uh, number eight, right? Is that what that was? Yes. Thank you. Yep, that's Fritz. Okay. Um, next I have, um, I got these from my friend Tammy. Um, these are a set of three Fitz and Floyd um, cups. And these are, yeah, I know, because I only have... Um, there's only one hand <laughs> on the clock. I have to get new hands for it and a couple other things. Um, that's why he's he's off on his timing. <laughs> but anyways, um, so you might remember these from the haul video that I did. Um, they're in they're in good condition. I do need to wash them. Um, we have an orange. A lem or a lime, a lemon, a lime, and then there's a flower on the other side. They all have the flower on the opposite side, and then no, this is the orange. This is the orange. Well, I don't know. They both look like oranges to me. We got this one. And we got this one. Don't they both look like oranges, guys? Hi, Debbie. How are you? So I think, 
I don't know. Or maybe one's a grapefruit. I have no idea. But anyways, I know one of them is a lime. <laughs> orange and a grapefruit. Okay. So we have an orange, a grapefruit, and a lime. Uh, you get all three mugs for $9, and they are number two. $9, number two. No, it's not a peach. It's a grapefruit and an orange and a lime. Yes. $9 for all three, number two. Uh, okay. All right. Um, let's do some Disney. I have this, uh, Walt Disney World. Uh, it says, celebrate the future hand in hand. And it, there it is, Walt Disney World. And it has all the different Disney characters on here. There's Epcot in the background. This was from, uh, was this from 2000? Yeah, this is from the, the, the millennium, from the year 2000. And um, it's probably, I would say, um, a 12 to 14 ounce cup. This is the bottom. And this cup is $8 and it's number 23. Eight dollars, number twenty-three, for the Disney, a Walt Disney World mug. Oh, this thing is getting on my last nerve. I can't. I still got four more weeks with this stupid sling. All right, I have another um, Walt Disney mug. This one is Tigger. <laughs> I love this mug and it's 3D. It is 3D, you can see that it sticks out and it's the same on both sides. Very, very clean, no chips, no cracks. This is probably, I would say, um, eight to 10 ounces. Oh, okay, Kevin, yeah. Uh, this one is $6, number 24. $6, number 24. Yes, I do, Mary. Um, well, these are all thrifted. Yeah. These were these are all thrifted, and I've had them put away, and um, I just forget about them. So I just decided to do a mug sale and try to get rid of some. But anyways, so yeah. I know, Dana. You know where it's you know where it's irritating me is on my on my hand here. You know. Oh my God, I hate this stupid thing. Uh, the only time I even take it off is to shower um, and to get changed. That's it. Um, sometimes I will take it off after I get up in the morning when I'm sitting and having my coffee. I'll take it off for like 15 minutes, but that's it. Okay. I have a, I have a lot of Starbucks mugs, guys. Oops, number 24, Denise Ellard. Uh, that was, was that Tigger? Yes. 
Oh my God, really, Peterson? Are you a glutton for punishment or what? Um, Denise, can you please make sure to email me your information? And I will put you down for Tigger. Thank you very much. Oh, you got hurt at work? Oh, I don't even know how I did this. I have no clue. So. Oh, really? Um, did you see the Oregon one, Christy, that I had? You have Denise? Okay, I'm sorry. I just, I can't remember everyone. It's like impossible. I can't even remember what I did yesterday. <laughs> so, <laughs> um, anywho, uh, <laughs> uh, so, oh, here. Oregon. Blue on the inside. Oh my God. I love this one. The colors are awesome. This is just a uh, sticker residue there. Um, this is $10 number 18 if you're interested, Christy. 10 bucks number 18 for that one. I need one that says crazy with a star and says you are here. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> All right. Uh, oh, Auntie Christy's going to take the uh, Oregon. Thank you, Christy. Uh, I love the colors of that mug. I know I said it about 18 times already. I can't help it, though. <laughs> All right, let me put that over here in the sold pile. I know, right? I, I had a Florida one, but my buddy Jeffrey bought that one. Um, okay, now I have a set of three mugs that are from Pier 1. They are... These mugs are the coolest thing ever. So what I have done is, um, let me just see right here. I'm going to charge $8 each for these mugs. I was going to sell them as a set of three, but I didn't think, I didn't know if I should do it as a set or singly. Hi, Pamela. So I'll show them to you, and then you guys can let me know what you think. But I'll show you. So these are all from Pier 1 Imports. We have the elephant mug. Oh, thank you. Look, he's got a little tail. <laughs> <clears throat> then we have... A parrot. Binks, what are you trying to do? Climb down my shirt? Hi, bud. I know I see you. How, how close are you going to get, buddy? And then we got the giraffe, which is my favorite one. Okay, so those are the three. Um, I just saw, um, okay, so whoever wants the parrot one, uh, type in the letter P for parrot. Oh my God. Okay, Zen Zord. 
I believe, gets the parrot. Okay, so the parrot goes to Zen. All right, so let me um, let me find him on here. Okay. Okay, so the the parrot goes to Zen. All right. Whoever wants the elephant, put in the letter E for elephant. Oh, constantly. Hi, Kylie. Leona. <laughs> I see Leona for the elephant. All right. The elephant goes to my girl Leona. All right, and whoever would like the giraffe, put in letter G for giraffe. Oh, you do, Tiger? I think this one's the best one. Leona. <laughs> Leona gets the giraffe one as well. Awesome. Oh, all right, giraffe, Leona, all right, there we go, awesome, hi Lynn, how are you? Okay, um, I have a really cool set for you guys today. It is Hazel Atlas. And this is what I have. So I have this Hazel Atlas. I'll show you the bottom. I don't know if you could see the HA. There's the HA on the bottom. Um, you get, this is like a terracotta color. You get the cup. The open sugar bowl. And the creamer. <laughs> you too, Irene. <laughs> and the creamer. And these are all in fantastic condition, like fantastic condition. So it's the three-piece set, creamer, sugar, and the coffee cup. You get all three for $12, number three. $12 for the set, number three. She said, me, 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 me. <laughs> Gabrielle Lish. Oh, let me set this over here, guys. Make myself some room. I'm trying to put the sold ones separately from the unsold. All right, there we go. Okay, Gabrielle gets the, what mug was that? Oh, that was the Hazel Atlas. Okay, Gabrielle. Gabby. Okay. Um, I have another elephant mug. This one, however, is not Pier 1 Imports. It is not marked at all, so I don't know who makes it. Um... It's, it's doing good. Um, I'm going to get the stitches out tomorrow. Oh, you're welcome, Gabby. Thank you. Going to get my stitches out tomorrow. So I'm sure that'll, you know, because they're itching, you know. So, hi, Virginia. When did you get in here? I didn't see you. 
But anyways, so, uh, yeah, we'll see what the doctor says tomorrow. I know I'm doing stuff I probably shouldn't be, but oh well, you know? Okay, this is an awesome elephant mug. Look at this one, guys. <laughs> he's got a lot of details, you know? He's got the wrinkled skin. Isn't this cool? I love this. Look at him. Trunk up. Yeah, this is a nice mug. I have to wash it because it's dirty, but there's no utensil marks or anything. Um, this is probably 14, 14 to 16 ounces. Uh, this one is $8, number seven. $8, number seven. It is. It's really cool. I love it. All right. I need a sip of my pop. Yeah, you definitely could. Absolutely. Because it doesn't look like a cup. So you really could. Okay. Um, I have a couple vintage cups here. Um, I've had, um, I have so many of these that I have to get rid of some. So um, that's why I'm going to sell a couple um, today if anybody would like them. This is, you asked for a half a cup of coffee. And it says Florida on the other side. <laughs> it's really cool. But I have like already have three or four of these. So I can't keep every single one. So, um, but I just thought this one was really cool with the Florida on it. This is $5 and it's number 36. $5, number 36. It's a good size, too. It's a it's a bigger one, for sure. Hi, Carrie. Did you? Jeffrey Ross gets a half a cup of coffee. <laughs> All right. Number 36. Okay. All right, so everybody's orders have left with the postman today, except for whoever hasn't paid yet. So I just wanted to let you guys know that too. Um, okay, here is another one. This one is 24 karat gold made in the USA. You said half a cup. You said just a half. I'm sorry, duh. Just a half. And um, it's just dirty inside. I just got to clean it out. Uh, there's, I don't even see any crazing on this one at all. No crazing. There's no paint loss on the gold or anything. This one's $3 and it's number 37. $3, number 37. <laughs> you know what I was using these for? Oh, Zen. I got you, Zen. These are nice to use to put like um, sweetener packets in or um, coffee stir sticks or you could put in here um, tea bags. That's what I was using mine for was my, um, my sugar packets. Yes. Okay, then. Thank you very much. It's sort of like a divorce reference. You need to lessen your caffeine intake. <laughs> All right. Okay. Um, I recently got these at um, a yard sale. Um... And 
these are really cool. Now, these would be perfect for, um, oh, what do you call it? For um, like cappuccino or something like that. Um, I and I they still have the stickers on them. This one just came off on this one. Um, I have two sets of two of these cups. These are little Maxwell House cups. These are eight ounce cups, I think. Six to eight ounces. Um, I do not believe these were ever used because they still were in their styrofoam um, packages. Um, so they, they were never used. And these are made in Japan. And there is the sticker. And I just think that these are so, so cool. Even for decor, I love them. So, um... As I said, they are, let me see, how do I put these back in here? Okay. So they come in this, um, they come in these like this. I don't have them in properly, but anyways. So I have two sets of two and um, each set is $8 and they are number five. $8 for the set, number five. Oh, I wonder how these go in here. I don't know. Holly Berry Treasures. Holly Berry, would you like um, just the one set of two or would you like all four? Uh, that would be $16 for all four if you want them. If not, the second set would go to Lynn. One set. Okay. So, Lynn, you'll get the other pair. Okay? So, Holly Berry Treasures. Um, please make sure to send me your information, okay, um, Holly Berry Treasures? And the other set goes to Lynn. All right. I drink anything in a mug. I actually... I have um, a set of six. I have a set of six Campbell soup mugs, and I eat ice cream out of those. <laughs> okay, thank you very much. Appreciate it. All right, I have a really cool mug right here. This one is a mustache. Um, mug and it is made in Japan it has the sticker on the bottom and this is this is really cool look at that isn't that sharp I love the handle the handle I think makes it it's very very cool Uh, this would probably hold, um, I would say, like 12 ounces. Uh, it's awesome. And it is $8, number 11. $8, number 11. There's the Japan sticker on there. No chips or anything. It does have some crazing, but I just thought it was really neat, even for decor purposes, you know. Very cool. It says um, Oldsmobile Curved Dash Runabout 1901. That's the kind of car that that is. Oldsmobile Curved Dash Runabout. It's pretty cool. 
pretty, pretty cool. Hang on one second, guys. I gotta grab a Kleenex because I have a runny nose, as I always do, and I forgot to bring some to the table with me. Okay. Oh, you want it, Lynn? Okay. You got it. I gotcha. Uh, where is it? Automobile mustache mug. Okay. Thank you, Lynn. All right. Um, I have some awesome uh, Steamboat Willie mugs. I have three of these. And they are 3D. Look at these, you guys. All three are exactly the same. They are 3D, as you can see how they stick out there. Steamboat Willie. And then on the other side, it says Mickey Mouse. And this is the bottom. Um, it says hand wash only. It doesn't say the ounces, but I can guarantee you this is 18 ounces all day long. That is a big cup. These are brand new, never used. They're all in excellent condition. These are going to be um, $10, and they are number one. $10, number one, and I have three. Ooh, hot flash. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my goodness. Oh, okay, I got Carol Verbeerst for one. <laughs> Thank you, Kevin. Okay, I have two left. Hi, Teresa. Yes, I do. It's terrible. Uh, Lynn, let me tell you what. About 20 minutes before my sale was going to start, oh my God, I got a really, really bad one. I mean, I was like soaked. And I'm like, oh my God, you too, Gabby? Oh, oh. And I couldn't find my, you know, my hand fan. I'm like, oh my God. Oh, hello, Shadow Family. Oh, all right. So it is. It, it's like you're, you're on fire from the inside out. Oh, my God, Peterson. Hope maybe you won't get them, you know. Hi, Tammy. You too? Oh, Lord. Oh, it is just horrendous. Yes, exactly. Um, okay, so if anybody's interested, I still have two more of the Steamboat Mickey mugs. Those were $10, number one. Um, I'm going to move on to this adorable... Oh, there's still sticker on here. Um... Since your 30s, oh my gosh. It's been like 12 years for me now. So, yeah. Yeah. Um, I have this set of four. Avon, um, they call them celebration mugs. Oh, that's okay, uh, Christina. I was showing everybody um, my glass of pop that I have today. I said, my girl, Christina Taylor got that for me. <laughs> I love it. 
Um, so yes, these are called celebration mugs and there is a set of four. I will show you the bottom. I love it. I love it. Oh, pl uh, trust me, I've done that. My mother used to go stand out on the back porch in the middle of winter with nothing on besides her clothes. I mean, like no coat or nothing. She would just go stand out on the porch. I'm like, what are you doing? Now I know why. Because I, I probably would stick my head in a snowdrift right about now. Um, so these are from 2004. And these were given to Avon representatives that were in the President's Club. And um, you got into the President's Club if you sold a certain amount of money within a year. It used to be $10,000. If you sold $10,000 within one calendar year, you would be in the President's Club. And you got, like, gifts and stuff like that. So we have this one. Then we have this beautiful purple, purple and white. We have the pink one. It looks like, um, it looks like a decorated cake. Hey, Paula. Hey, kitschy cat. And then there's this blue one and they're all in perfect condition. There's no cracks, no chips on any of them. There's no crazing. So you will get the set of four. Let's see if I can do this. <laughs> the set of four <laughs> for $12, number 20. The set of four for $12, number 20. They're so pretty. I love them. Oh, Lynn. I got you, Lynn. They're gorgeous. They really are beautiful. Avon makes some beautiful things. Goes to Lynn. All right. Yeah, these are gorgeous. I'm actually going to set them over here with these other ones. These are gorgeous. I'm actually going to set them over here with these other ones. Okay, I sold one of the Mickey Mouses. These can go over here. This is all the... Oh, Gina bought that one. Okay. Okay. Do we have any hockey fans out there? Any Chicago Blackhawk hockey fans? Buffering? Uh-oh. You're lagging, are you? Um, Shadow Family... Make sure you're in live chat and not top chat. And you might want to refresh, like go totally out of YouTube and then go back in and then make sure that you're in live chat. Getting rid of what? Okay. Okay. I have this really nice, this is like brand new, guys. Um, this is a Chicago Black Hawks coffee mug. This is beautiful condition. It has the, um, the Native American on both sides. And it says the Chicago Black Hawks on the handle. Um, beautiful red color on the inside. And it actually has a holographic sticker. Let me take this off. 
um, on the bottom, an NHL, and then it has the NHL logo. Oh, Ray Dunn, yeah. Um, this is going to be $6, and it's number 10. $6, number 10 for the Chicago Blackhawks. It's buffering again, Lynn. Christina Taylor for number 10. Thank you, man. Hi, Annie P. How are you, sweetie? All right, it is time to get rid of some Starbucks cups because I have a poop ton. Let's start with this one. This is the only one I have that has a chip. So let me show you. Take the sticker off. The chip is right here on the very bottom. See that? Okay. This is a gorgeous, this is like a stoneware um, cup with a satiny glaze. It's in perfect condition except for that chip on the bottom. This is 16 fluid ounces and it is from 2006. Um, this, these have been sitting on a shelf in my eBay room for a while, so I mean, I have to wipe them out before I package them up because that's just dust in the bottom. Um, it has the siren on here, the mermaid siren. And this is $8 and it is number 17. $8 number 17 for the 16 ounce cup. Oh, look it, it's even got the little things on the side that you would mark with a, with a marker. <laughs> it's kind of cool. Okay, see you later, Maria. Thanks for popping in, honey. All right. Next, I have this Starbucks mug. This one is from 2005. Oh, hi, Roxana. Thank you. Um, this is beautiful. Look at this one. Absolutely gorgeous. It's got Starbucks in green on the inside. It's in perfect condition. No issues at all. This one is, uh, let me see. This one's probably 16 ounces. It doesn't say, but I think it's probably 16 ounces for sure. 14 or 16. I would say 14. Um, this one is $8, number 22. Hi, Heavenbound Farm. How are you? $8, number 22 for this beautiful blue floral mug. Uh. Oh, Deanne. Deanne Campbell. I think that's who got it. Let me know. Yep. Okay. Deanne Campbell for number 22. That was popular. Thank you, Deanne. All right, next up, I have a Starbucks Christmas cup with Binks's hair in it. That's free. <laughs> um, this one is microwave and dishwasher safe. It is 14 ounces, and this one is from 2014. And it is this awesome Christmas tree. It's gold. It's gold.
Very, very cool. Uh, this one is going to be $8 and it's number 16. $8, number 16. Hey, Ree Homer, how are you? I knew I recognized that name. All right, uh, let's do this cup. I have this adorable little snowman cup. Look how cute this is. Oh, 16. Miss Virginia. Virginia wants number 16. I got you, Virginia. Oh. Thank you. Next I have, no, I haven't heard anything, Lynn. Has anybody else? She had her surgery today, right? Was that today? I can't keep nothing straight. Oh, is it Mary? Where are, Mary, where are you? Are you in Pennsylvania? Because we were supposed to have thunderstorms today. It did rain a little bit, but it was nothing major. Oh, she had it today, okay. Okay, that poor woman has been through hell. I feel bad for her. Um, exactly. Oh, okay, Mary, gotcha. All right, um, this is an adorable little white and blue snowman cup. <laughs> he's shoveling, and it looks like he's got an awful long way to go. <laughs> oh, absolutely. Look how cute this one is. I love this cup. Uh, this one is made by HMK. And I would say this is probably um, a 10 ounce cup, 10 to 12 ounce. And this one is $5, number 13. $5, number 13 for the snowman cup. Oh, Hallmark, yes. Do, do, do. <laughs> That would be correct. <laughs> oh, hi, Carolyn. Hi, Linda. <laughs> yep. Hi, Lisa. How are you? Okay, so Carolyn Whitney gets the snowman cup. Yeah, that makes sense. Hallmark. I'll be all right. I'll remember that next time, though. Carolyn Whitney. She gets the little snowman mug. Thank you, Carolyn. That was number 13, right? Yep, okay. All right. Um, back to Starbucks. <laughs> this is another really nice mug. It is from 2017, and it is uh, 14 ounces. And it just has the, the mermaid on the front, or the siren, I guess they call it. Starbucks. Excellent condition. No issues whatsoever with this cup. This one is $8, number 26. $8, number 26. Yeah, I got a lot of Starbucks mugs. I should just try to list them on eBay, but, you know. Oh, are you, Lynn? That must have been a very exciting job. Always something different. Hi, Jeannie. How are you? 
Okay. I have this Starbucks mug. This one's really neat. Hi, Denise. This one is, um, it just says Starbucks Coffee Company. Really, Paula? Oh, I love my coffee. And it's this beautiful blue color on the inside. Isn't that a pretty blue? That's almost like the color of my bathroom, you guys. Um, my name on eBay is The Thrill of the Thrift. Um, Starbucks coffee is very, very, very strong. <laughs> very, very, very strong. You definitely could grow hair on your chest. Um, yeah, it's a cool shape. This one is um, 13 ounces, and this one is from 2007. And this one is $6, number 21. $6, number 21. I used to just, I used to just drink tea. And then I got away from the tea and back to the coffee. Hi, Nathan. I'm doing good. How are you? All right, I have, um, this was just sent to me by my friend, um, Frog Larry. Um, this is really cute. We got just a little, uh, it looks like a little um, English cottage and an English garden with a little kitty cat sitting on the, uh, the stone wall. And there's some chickens and a well. Oh, I love Tim Hortons. Yeah, they have mugs. Tim Hortons sells mugs. Um, this cup is probably, I would say 10 ounces. Um, it's brand new. And I'm trying to see who makes it. Let me look on the back. Royal Burlington, Staffordshire, a bone china. Um, this one is four dollars, number thirty-two. Four dollars, number thirty-two. Skunky junk. Oh, Linda Dickerhoff for number thirty-two. Got you, Linda. How are you feeling, Linda? Skunky Junk Sean, how's it going? All right. See above for 21. Denise Ellard for number 21. I got you, Denise. Thank you, um, Peterson. I was going to say Ferguson. <laughs> Denise Ellard. <laughs> All right. <laughs> um, next I have, um, this one I just thought, <laughs> Peterson, Ferguson, whatever works. <laughs> this one I just bought because I just couldn't help myself because it was so damn cute. Look at this. This is a milk glass mug. Look how cute this is. I love grandma. Would you look at that little face? Oh my goodness. This is an eight ounce cup for those of you trying to cut down on your caffeine. <laughs> this is so, so cute. I absolutely love this. Um... This one is only five dollars, 
number 15. <laughs> Five dollars, number 15. No, I'm not going to keep it. Grandma would need a much larger cup than this. <laughs> it is just so cute. I love it. What is craft dinner? That's macaroni and cheese. Craft macaroni and cheese. I only have... Um, I have... Two Disney cups. I have this one, which is actually a Starbucks Disney mug. And I got to wash it. This is a uh, Starbucks. No, no, not yet, unfortunately, Annie, but I'm sure it'll happen at some point. Um, this is Starbucks Walt Disney World. On one side, it has the, the Mermaid Siren. On the other side, it has the 45th anniversary of Magic Kingdom. Uh, this is in perfect condition. Uh, I'm pretty sure this is, I had the ounces written down somewhere. Uh, let me see, I'm reading it the wrong way. Do, 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 do. 16 ounces, microwave and dishwasher safe. Um, Oh, okay, Gabby, you want the grandma mug? This one is $10, and it's number 28. $10, number 28, for the Starbucks Magic Kingdom Cup. Okay, Gabby, I'll put that down for you. And, okay, who got number 28 first? Christina? Well, you're welcome. Okay, Christina Taylor gets number 28. All right. Um, Christina, the other um, Disney cup that I have is, I have this one. I have two of these left. I had three, I sold one. It is the uh, Steamboat Willie, Mickey Mouse, it's the cartoon. It is 3D. You can see how it sticks out, it's 3D. And on this side it says, Mickey Mouse. And it has all the information on the bottom. Um, I had my shoulder surgery, Barb, to fix the rotator cuff. Um, so let me see. This is probably, I would say, uh, uh, 16 ounces. 16 to 18 ounces. Um, the Mickey Mouse cups are $10 and they are number one. $10, number one. I'm doing really good, Barb. I'm surprised. I had, I had like little to no pain, which is a miracle to me. So, yeah, it was, I can't even believe it. It was crazy. Okay, Denise Cabral gets one. And Heavenbound Farm gets the other one. Aw, thank you, Jeannie. Okay, Denise. Well, hold on a second. Let me do this first, uh, to be fair. Denise, you were first. Um, do you want one or do you want both mugs? Because you were the first one, so I have to give you choice 
of one or both. And if you don't want both, then the other one will go to, um, okay, just one. Okay. So Denise gets one. And the other one went to a uh, heaven bound firm. Okay. All right, thank you so much, ladies. Let me put this over here with the sold ones. Yeah, those are those are pretty big, hefty mugs. <laughs> All right. Um, okay, next up I have um if there's any poodle fans out there. Okay, Denise, um, you are gonna email me. My email, one of the, the blue wrenches will put my email address in the chat for you. What you're going to do is you're going to email me your real name, your YouTube name if it's different, your mailing address with the zip code, and your PayPal email address. And what I will do is I will send you um, an invoice uh, for the price of the item you purchased and the shipping, because shipping is, is not included. Okay? Excuse me, guys. I got like a hair or something in my eye. Okay, next I have uh, this little poodle mug. Uh, my friend Corey gave this to me. It came with the... Uh, um, with a little container, but I can't remember what I did with it. <laughs> but it just has the poodles on one side. Uh, I would say this is like um, eight to 10 ounces. It's $4 and it's number 31. $4, number 31. Add some grilled onions to that burger, Nate. Oh my God, I know I love I love any kind of onions, grilled, raw, whatever. All right. Um, next, I have oh, okay. Carol Verbeerst wants number thirty-one. <laughs> All right. Um, next, I have this. Um, this is a really nice Starbucks mug. It's um, it's like a an ivory color, and it's like a stoneware. It's a four a sixteen ounce cup, and it's from two thousand and fourteen. And it is this one with the uh, the mermaid. And then it has Starbucks right over here in black writing. And it's in perfect condition. This cup is $8, number 33. $8, number 33. Yes, Fritz is my cuckoo clock bird. That's what his name is. <laughs> He's a little off on his time. <laughs> okay, Zen Zord, I got you. All right. Pretty much what I have left is all Starbucks mugs. So I'm just going to show them and... Um, I, I only have one cup left that is not Starbucks. So let me do the Starbucks ones, and then I'll do the last um, regular one. Um, this one is a 14-ouncer from 2013. It's uh, like a off-white color. You got your mermaid on there. Starbucks. Plain on the other side. And like I said, this one is 14, 
14 ounces. This one is $8 and it's number 38. $8 number 38 for that one. Uh, then I have this one. This one's kind of cool. I've never seen, this one is a Starbucks barista um, mug. Very, very cool. And it's very simple. It just has your little, your little cup of coffee there with the steam coming off and a blue, um, a blue um, line, but that's not what I was trying to say, like a trim or whatever. And it's green, not blue. <laughs> a green line. And it also has the same picture on this side. Okay, go eat dinner, Paula. So this one is $6.00. And it's number 34, $6, number 34, rim. Thank you, Claire. <laughs> Linda Dickerhoff, she gets number 34. Yep, that was the word that I couldn't think of. <laughs> Thank you, Miss Linda. I'll try to make sure all of Binks's hair is out of the cups before I ship them. <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay, uh, next I have, this is a, this one's a really nice cup. This is a 16 ounce cup from 2016. And this one is nice and like, it's kind of like squatty more like compact looking. Hi, Thomas. And so your handle's here and your mermaid is over here. Very, very. <laughs> no, Binks will not be attached to the hairs. <laughs> Um, this is $8, number 30. $8, number 30. <laughs> All right. Vintage Digs Gina. I got you. Thank you. Okay, so let me do this one regular, um, this last Starbucks mug. Um, this one is from 2010. It's 14 ounces, and it is another one with the uh, mermaid siren on the front. Starbucks. Very clean. No cracks, no chips. Has a little bit of uh, paint loss in a couple spots. See there, there, and right there. Uh, this one is $6, and it is number 14. $6, number 14. Uh... Gina, Gina, you like the ones with the mermaid on it, huh? I got you. All right. And the last one I have, this is an old one. Um, I just thought it was kind of cute. I've never seen anything like it. Yes, ma'am. Did you see all the other ones I showed? Because I got like four left of the, the mermaids. Um, well, I'm going to go over the stuff that didn't sell. But um, I got this one. This has a little blue-eyed man with his little sideburns and his mustache. 
And on the other side, it says pop. <laughs> this is an eight ounce cup. Um, it does have crazing and some discoloration on the bottom. Uh, I probably, I would, I don't know if I would drink from this. I mean, you could um, because it's old. Yes, um, I just think he would make a cool um, decoration, actually. I think he's really neat. Um, you could put like grated cheese in him when you're having spaghetti dinner and put him on the table. Wouldn't that look cute? <laughs> um, anyways, this guy is $4 and he's number 35, $4 number 35, <laughs> Gina, <laughs> yes, you could put an air plant, <laughs> I just thought he was really cute, just kind of unique, you know, oh, James Hooker, you got it, James. Thank you. All right. That's the pop cup. Oops. All right. Okay. Um, let me go over um, the cups that didn't sell really quickly here because I don't know who else has a sale coming up but I don't want to impede on anybody else's time um okay so um I have the Walt Disney World cup I forgot to show you guys this one the um Oh, what's her name that asked me about the Disney cups? I forgot about this one. I'm very sorry. This is the Walt Disney World um, Epcot. It's got the Epcot and has all the, the different characters. Um, it says celebrate the future hand in hand. This one is $8, number 23. $8, number 23 for the Walt Disney World Cup. Oh, this thing. Oh, Linda. Linda, number 23. Okay. Okay, so Linda gets that one. Um, next was the set of three Fitz and Floyd fruit cups. We have a grapefruit, an orange, and a lime. There's the orange. This is the grapefruit. And this is the lime. And they all have a flower on the other side. Uh, these are probably 10 ounces, I would say. Fitz and Floyd, you get the set of three for $9, number two. $9, number two for the set of three Fitz and Floyd mugs. Oh, Linda, Linda, number two. All right. Next, I have this gorgeous, precious moments Christmas time cup. Just beautiful, perfect condition, no cracks, no chips, no crazing. And you know what? This, I just thought of this. This would look absolutely beautiful with some fairy lights in it because you can kind of see through it. 
you know? And I just thought it would be gorgeous with some fairy lights in there. Um, this one is $7, number 27. Yes, they would, exactly. $7, number 27. Okay. Um, I have this awesome elephant mug. Look at this guy. He is amazing. <laughs> He's got all of his elephant wrinkles going on. Perfect condition. There's no maker's mark on it, so I don't know who makes it. But this guy is $8, and he is number seven. $8, number seven. Oh, Linda, Linda. He's cool, Linda. He really is. He's, I love him. And you know what? You don't even have to use him as a cup. As one of the other girls was saying, you could use him as a planter. He would look cool with a spiky plant coming out. It would look like he was like spraying water. Right? That would be really cool. Okay. Then we have this beautiful little snowman cup. This one is made by Tag. It says hope. We got the snowman and some snowflakes. Yes, or a little mini palm tree. There you go, Peterson. Um, it's green on the inside, perfect condition. This is probably a 16 ounce um, cup. Uh, it is $8 and it's number nine. $8, number nine. Oh, Linda. Got you, Linda. Oh, wait a minute, Linda. Linda, I'm sorry. My mistake. Uh, wait, hold on a second. Jeffrey Ross bought that cup already. I'm sorry. Sorry about that. I had it in the wrong pile. <laughs> so I apologize for that. That's been sold. Okay. Um, so let me see. I have the last ones I have left are all Starbucks mugs. We have this one, this one is a 16 ounce cup. It's $8, number 30. This one is a 14 ounce cup. It is a cream color. It is uh, $8, number 38. $8, number 38. And I think I saw Zen for number 30. Okay, I got Zen for number 30. Wait a minute. That one sold already. That one went to Gina. What the hell? <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I got confused. Hold on, let me make sure these aren't sold. This one's not. Okay, this one's not. This one's not. This one's not. And this one's not. Okay. I know, nap time, right? <laughs> All right, so. All right, Zen. Zen, you want this one. 
Number 26. Okay, this one goes to Zen. This one's number 26. This one is $8. He must have saw the sticker on the bottom. <laughs> All right, Zen. Okay. Okay, this one is was not sold. This one is the cream colored mermaid one. This one is 14 ounces. It is $8, number 38. Right, exactly, Sean. <laughs> I think I need to have a drink. Maybe that's what the problem is. Number 38, $8 for this one. <laughs> Holy moly. I have this poodle cup. This one is probably t a 10 ouncer. This one's $4 and it's number 31. And the last one is this beautiful, like a stoneware with the mermaid. Oh, James Hooker wants number 31. Oh, nope, that's sold. I'm sorry. That one sold too already, the poodle cup. It's time for me to go to bed. It is time for me to go to bed. James, I am sorry. I am sorry. This is the... <laughs> Virginia. <laughs> you know what it was? <laughs> yeah, I got it, Carol. I saw that after the fact. I'm so sorry. This is the last cup. This one has not yet sold. This is the nice stoneware mug. It's got the mermaid on both sides. <laughs> and the only issue is it has this chip right here on the bottom. That is $8, as you can see, and it's number 17. $8, number 17, and it's 16 ounces. 16 ounces. I'm one-armed. That's right. That's my excuse. It's 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 like affecting the brain or something. I don't know. <laughs> okay, so that's it. I got these two left. And this one. Any takers. Last call. Last call. <laughs> Maybe I should go have a cup of coffee. <laughs> you know? Maybe I should just have a cup of coffee. All right, everybody. <laughs> That's it for this coffee mug only pop-up sale. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I just thought it was something a little bit different. Yes, in a Starbucks mug, because I got two left that I can use. <laughs> um, but anyways, I, I, I do hope you guys uh, had fun. And I will see you in my sale on Saturday. So don't forget about that one. You have to use cups with lids. Are they sippy cups, Sean? Because <laughs> I really could use, I do like the ones with the lids, you know? Aw, uh, thank you, Jeannie. Can you change number 26 to 38? Okay, hold on. Okay, this is 26. Yes. Okay. So hang on. Okay, so Zen wants this one and not number 26. Okay. All right. Got you, Zen. Does anybody want this one? Because Zen uh, switched. 
This one is uh, blah, 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 from 2017, and it's 14 ounces. No problem. No problem. Thank you. Thank you so much. All right. Okay. That's it, guys. Peterson, everybody that helped me out, thank you so much to, to my moderators. You guys are awesome. This one's back on the market. If anybody wants it, let me know. $8, number 26. Snippy cups I leave for my boss. I use sippy cups. <laughs> All right. Okay, so I will, um, I'll start packing these up tomorrow um, after my doctor's, well, no, I'm going to go to Salvation Army tomorrow after my doctor's appointment. So um, I will get these packaged up tomorrow, which will be Wednesday, and I will send invoices out for the cups and stuff on Thursday. Uh, thanks, Sean. <laughs> Thank you very much. So invoices probably on Thursday for the cups, possibly Wednesday. It just depends what time I get home from gallivanting. So, <laughs> all right, guys, thank you so much. And I will see you guys uh, in my next sale or in the chat at the other live sales. Yes, my little Binksy, he's curled up on the chair in the living room now. All right, guys, I'll see you later. Bye. Thank you for coming.